Quick Notes is a new feature in iPadOS 15. They allow us to quickly start a new note or add to a note without first going into the Notes app. So let's look at how we can create a new Quick Note. Option 1 is a swipe up from the bottom right corner of the iPad's display. This will work with a finger or an Apple Pencil. If you use a keyboard with your iPad, you can hold down the globe key and tap Q. It's also possible to add a quick note button into Control Center. When activated, the quick note window can be moved around to different corners of your display. Tap in the window to bring up the keyboard and start adding to your note. When done adding to the note, tap and drag from the top handle of the window to the edge of the display to hide the Quick Notes window. We're able to quickly get it back with a tap on the tab here. The Quick Notes window is able to float over the interface as other apps are opened. When you're in certain apps like Safari or Maps, an Add Link button will appear at the top of the note. Tap and that link is then saved within the note. Tap the Done button and the note will be saved and closed. There won't be a tab to quickly reopen it anymore. We'll need to swipe up from the lower right again to get the quick note back. To start fresh with a new quick note, just tap the new button in the upper right of the quick note window. As multiple quick notes are created, they get saved in a quick notes folder within the notes app. We can quickly jump into this folder with a tap on the grid button from here in the quick notes window. Tap and drag to move a saved quick note into other notes folders. Tap and hold on a quick note for other options, including the option to delete the quick note. We can also share or delete a quick note from its window using the ellipsis button. In the lower right, we can bring up the markup tools to create a sketch within the quick note. This will most likely be more useful for Apple Pencil users. With an Apple Pencil, we can create handwritten quick notes as well as use markup for sketches. Use the handwriting to text pen to automatically convert your handwriting to editable text. In Notes Settings, we have one option for Quick Notes. With this on, each time I bring up the Quick Note window, the last Quick Note that I had open will be presented. Turn this off, and each time the Quick Notes window is accessed, a new Quick Note is going to be created. On an iPhone, Quick Notes work just as any other Notes folder. There's no shortcut for adding a quick note on an iPhone like there is on iPad and Mac. We are able to add or edit quick notes from the quick notes folder on iPhone though. Take a look at the quick notes lesson in the What's New in macOS Monterey tutorial to see how they work on your Mac.